Hey guitar players, today I'm going to break down five essential turnarounds for finger picking blues guitar. These are turnarounds I use all the time and they sound great. Um, we're going to start off with this first one here. It's going to hit the low E string open and then we're going to go to the fourth fret third string. You can add some spice to that by sliding into that note. And then we're going to pinch that with the open E string, high E. And just move it down one fret at a time. And we're going to walk up to the B7 chord. Try that again. That's pretty cool. Even if you just learn that one, you'll have a really nice sounding turnaround. Now I did want to let you know I've got all five of these turnarounds available as a PDF download. I'll put the link for that in the description, so be sure to check that out. Let's move on to turnaround number two. This is a nice one, uses a parallel sixth harmony. So we're going to hit the low E string, then we're going to go, I like to put my middle finger on fifth fret, fifth string, and then my index finger on fourth fret, third string. We're going to pinch those and hit the open E and just move it down. And walk up to the B7. Also slide into this one just like we did on the first one. Adds an extra nice flavor to it. All right, cool. Let's jump into turnaround number three. This one is really uh, mostly I've heard Muddy Waters do this one. It's kind of unique because it's an ascending turnaround. So we're going up the fretboard instead of down the fretboard. We're going to hit the low E. Then we're going to go here with the first fret, third string. And we're going to go second fret, third fret, fourth fret, walk up to the B7 chord. Here's what it sounds like. Let's move on to turnaround number four. So this is uh, similar to a turnaround that Robert Johnson does. We're going all the way up to the 12th fret. Pretty exciting. Uh, put your pinky on 12th fret first string, your third finger on 12th fret fourth string. We're going to low E as usual. That's your first beat. And we're going to go down here and pinch fourth and first string and hit the first string again and lower this to the 11th fret. Same thing. 10th fret. Ninth fret. Now we're going to walk up to that B7 again. So it goes. Got to do a little shifting there to get back down to it. All right, so we got one more turnaround, turnaround number five. Let's check it out. This one, um, similar to one that Big Bill Brunzi does, one of my big blues heroes. And this one, we're going to use some triplets. We haven't used triplets yet in these turnarounds, but that's what these series of notes are. This is a very nice symmetrical pattern. So we go low E, then we go open first, second on the fifth string, open first, second on the fourth string, then go back to the fifth string and do the same thing. And then hit your E chord. So here's what it sounds like. One. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Again. One. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. All right, so we made it through all five turnarounds. Now I'm going to run through all of them one after another, just so you can practice them. Um, once again, be sure to grab that free PDF so you can follow along. Here we go. Turnaround number one. Again. Turnaround. 
round number two. Number three. Number five. All right, thanks for checking out this video. I hope you found it useful. Be sure to subscribe to my channel to get more videos like this. I appreciate it. Thank you so much.